potato aquaponics a vine raft thingy out of styrofoam I have my bucket I have my two sweet potato vines I have my styrofoam and now I'm gonna clean out the soil away from the roots and see how many potential potatoes I got this one looks really pretty. Okay, so that one's clean. Okay. So now this one's ready. Cool. So I'm gonna use a lighter. I'm just kinda like heat a hole through here and here, and maybe a little one here and there, just in case we wanna put other plants in there later on. But that's what I'm doing now. So I prefer to burn it instead of punching holes in it. So it like will go down at like a tapered thing, you know, kind of like goes in tapered a little bit. And it doesn't get all crumbly on the edges when, instead of like when you try to poke shit through it. So there's that. Okay, so there's that. I'm just laying them over like that. Got some little roots sticking out. Let's try to grow some potats. Some potatoes. So these are gonna probably go into my 20 long until I get more bin space, some actual rubber maids, and then everything else is going out into the garden. Eventually. Cool. I'm gonna make a couple more of these. Structures. Let's see how crazy this gets, how fast. Awesome. Now, it's just my peppers. Uh, it's gonna snap. I promise you it's gonna snap. It's gonna snap, it's gonna snap, it's gonna snap, it's gonna snap. It's gonna snap. It's gonna snap. Safe. So, with this kind of foam, I'm gonna just stab holes in it. Because I don't know if melting is actually gonna be a good idea for this kind. Okay, so I need two, four, six, eight, ten. I should have twelve holes, but it looks like I'm missing one from over there. Awesome. I don't know how easy it's gonna actually be to push the stalks through. So that might take me a minute. Um, but, cool little idea, if you want to do this, but it's not already a grown plant and you want to just do seedlings, just make sure the foam is like half the thickness, and that might be what I end up needing to do, is cut this down. Um, I'll find out here in a second. Um, but if it's half the thickness, you can take burlap, from like a burlap bag, and wrap it all the way around the whole thing, and then place the little seeds over the holes and so the burlap will absorb moisture from underneath and it'll soak up into this whole thing and uh, it'll soak up over the sides of the foam and uh, get the seeds wet and then the seeds will eventually push through the burlap and then come out of the holes at the bottom. Cool. 
Okay, so there's the, I did have to cut it in half, but there's one third of it done. Okay, so we got the banana peppers, jalapenos and jalapenos. Yay! And I still have two slots over here and one slot back in there for this. But we're gonna take this right now and we're gonna plop it into these guys. Oh, come on, fit, don't be gay. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that'll work, that's cool. Dope, awesome.